Hi, I'm Gerard John. Welcome to Flixworks Interviews. What was your inspiration for the feature song of Tendance Adama? Do you have any musical examples? See, with this track, I take most of my composition in a way of like if, you're, if I'm cooking. And the best way I can describe this track was, was a, a mixture of ingredients to make this track work. So basically, it was a, two pieces of music that inspired me uh, tremendously. One was an old Bollywood track way back in the early 70s. It was from a film called Amar Prem. And the title of the song was called Rena Bite Jaye. And what was interesting about that track was there was a sense of this guy coming up the stairs and then hearing this voice and how he was so moved by her, by her voice. But it was also the rag that was in that piece of music. So that was one piece of music. And uh, the next one was, was Ernio Morricone's music from Melina. Again, it was a similar thing in that there was this uh, Monica Bellucci walking down and all these boys were looking at her and but it was the same sense of amazement and putting those two together and spending time in Milan especially in Brera in Milan and walking the streets and having these songs continuously in my head and then playing them on YouTube um, then it was just like going into the kitchen you know, say on the piano and then picking up all the ingredients because after that was just a piece of cake really. How did you approach the soundtrack to the film? I went back again for the soundtrack of the film. I took a time period from 1969 till about 1973. And I really studied all the Italian composers along with Morricone as well. And I went for a lyrical aspect of the composition. So it had to be romantic and it had to be lyrical and it had to have a flourish to the music. And there was a certain dark element to the music. So I used a chord from Wagner called the Wagnerian chord. And that was in the opera scene. And from there, I was able to base the music and work it around from that scenario. So in essence, it was a combination of Germanic and Italian, but I used more of the Italian romantic composition because we, we shot it in Milan. And that made it so much easier. And that way, that all the the dramatic elements of the music, uh, I went back more to a Germanic aspect to it, and the combination of that again, like the song, really worked well for that process. 